so do you have any idea about law if you don't then let's understand what is a blog so a blog is an online journal or a website displaying information in the reverse chronological order with the latest post appearing first at the top so basically black it is a platform where a writer or a group of writers share their views on an individual subject so it is a definition of blog so let's understand more about it what is the purpose of blog see there are many reasons to start a blog for personal use and only a handful of strong ones for business blogging blogging for business projects or anything else that might bring you money has a very straightforward purpose or to rank your website higher in google to increase your visibility so you can say the main purpose of a blog is to connect you to the relevant audience and uh, another one is to boost your traffic and send quality leads to your website next one is your blog structure so the appearance of blogs has changed over time and these days blogs include a wide variety of items and wizards most blogs still include some standard features and structure so here is the structure of blog here are common features that is the header part with the menu or navigation bar then the main content area with highlighted or latest blog post then the sidebar with social profiles favorite content or call to action and the last one is your footer bar which includes relevant links like a privacy policy contact page etc so this is the basic structure of a blog next is what differentiates blogs from websites many people cannot understand the difference between uh, like difference between the blog and the website so let's understand a difference between blogs and websites see blog needs frequent updates blog also promote reader engagement readers have a chance to comment and voice their different concerns and thoughts blog owners update their site with new blog post on a regular basis whereas on the other hand websites consist of content presentation presented on static static pages static means that uh, we only present the content on our website so one major difference is that static websites owners rarely update their pages whereas blogs need to be updated frequently okay so these are some basic things about uh, blogs and websites now next is uh, in today's session we will learn how to create your beautiful blog website before that i want to explain you one thing why is blogging becoming so blog so popular it is popular because it became a mainstream source of information you can get as much as information from the blogs through blogging companies keep clients and customers up to date through blog visitors can comment interact with you or your brand also you can earn money from blogging or through blogging so now let's understand how to create a blog free of cost so creating your beautiful blog website is easy first is the free one website is your blogger.com blogger.com is a website which allows you to create a blog free of cost so these are some steps to creating a blog let me show you the practical of how to create a blog so first of all just open blogger.com
so here is the blogger.com this is used to publish your passions your way create a unique and beautiful blog it's easy and free so creating blog by blogger.com is as easy as also it is a free no cost is charged for this blogger.com so how to create this blog see when you first try to make a blog you have to click on create your blog and when your blog is created and you want to access your blog then you have to do sign in for that purpose so here as i am going to start first time so let's me just click on create your blog by creating your blog it will ask you for the google account or gmail account so if you have any gmail account then you have to sign in with that particular account or you have to make a google account gmail account so let me use my google account enter the password next so here is the first interface of blogger.com okay so here you uh, you can see here is a link that is to create a blog so just click on that it will ask you about the name of a blog see it must be unique if it already exist then this will not allowed by blogger.com see i want to try just write by computer if i write computer just creating blog choose a name for your blog first of all you have to mention the name of your blog so i'll just write web design then next then simply you have to choose a url for your blog url means see the form resource locator that what is the address of your blog if you want to give your blog address to someone then what will you say like if you are using gmail.com then you say na no, open the gmail.com or if you want to open hdfc bank site then you say open the hdfc bank.com so a uh, blog address must be uh, unique so just write here suppose if i write computer so it is saying sorry this blog address is not available that means someone already is using a blog by naming this computer so so address of your blog is just like computer.blogspot.com so if i say web design 2020 so i think uh, this blog address is not available this is not available so if i just add something more like scpt that is september so this blog address is available now click on save now it is the interface or it is the first window of your blog creation so here is the name of my blog that is this see if you want to make more than one blogs then by doing new blog you can create uh, blogs more than one and the list is came here like web designing showing here if you click on this you will get uh, another blogs so now what to do we have to select a template if we want to use a uh, here are many links like post new post stats comments so we will see these all one by one and uh, how to make post how to use uh, comments if someone comment on your post then by this comments you will see the all the comments as we have nothing in our blog there are no new comments earnings Uh, for earnings you have to create a adsense account and for that purpose first you have to make your content of a blog is unique and 
as many as users like your blog post or visit your blog post this pages one part will create pages in the blog that uh, in particular website we are making uh, pages web pages so here it will done by this pages post is particularly uh, curly just like an article on a web page then layout layout means what is the layout you want for your blog like here are many things like you want a header part you want subscription part you want sidebar or page list top ads many things you want if you want to use here then you can add it by this layout window next part is your theme see theme is just like to select like a template it will work like a template if you select a particular thing like if uh, i want the this one so here just i want to see the preview so here is the preview of this uh, theme uh, it's showing my name of a uh, blog and uh, as i had i haven't added anything that's why it is blank so it is the preview part see if you want to use this theme as your blog theme you simply apply okay now your blog will use this particular theme and you can customize this theme by here settings part include many types of settings related to your blog that the name title description if you want to add some description part about your blog you can add here then language dull content show warning to blog readers if you want to give any warning just like the content is not for our uh, kids etc then privacy visible to search engines or not that if you want to Uh, your blog will be searched by users on search engines then click on that otherwise uh, uncheck it okay publishing the blog address is there then if you want custom domain custom domain means like if you want to uh, a new domain that means here you see when you want to open your blog you have to write web design sep 2020.blogspot.open if you want a custom domain that on your choice then use this part then some permissions then post uh, max post shown on main page how many posts you want to show on a particular page or posts so for comments part so these are settings for every part of your blog we will discuss each one by one here at the end if you want to delete your blog see if you don't don't want this blog just here is a link remove your blog just click on it it will simply delete your blog by clicking on the delete window it will delete the blog and if you want to delete it permanently then click on permanently delete or if you have delete this blog by mistake then undelete it so if i want to delete it permanently just click on permanently delete it will delete the blog so here you can see there is no blog there is again we are seeing a link that is name create blog okay so so in previous session we have learnt about what is a blog and how it is differ from a website so now let's understand from scratch how to make a blog first of all after login by your gmail account you will get this particular page click on this link that is a create blog button then give the title of this particular blog suppose i just want to give the name of my college sanatan Dharm College. Then move to next. It will ask you about the blog spot address, address of your blog, or you can say the URL of your blog. I'll just use S D C A M B C. This is already uh, used by someone, and just 
used to write 2020 so this blog address is available let's save this file so here is the interface of blogging when you want to post or when you create pages then uh, by this interface you can do that see uh, here is the post part list understand how to use this part just click on new post see you will get uh, a way, uh, box here to type your text what you want to write here see i'll just simply write some text about like html or as it is about my college sanatan dharma college ambala so let me write some text about my college okay just copy from it copy from here and just simply type here paste here okay so here are the parts post settings how to uh, if you want to make setting see here you can get uh, formatting tools also so if you want to change the formatting of this text you can do that by selecting this you can make it bold if you want to change the color then you can change the color also okay so anything any formatting tool many formatting tools are there you can use any of them labels see separate labels by commas labels means like uh, it is about my college if you want to give a name uh, name label just like about college so you can give that then next is published on when you want to publish this particular page particular post on web so here is the timing if you want to set it date and time you can set it here otherwise select the automatic button then here is the link that is the permanent link so it is the automatic link generated by this blog if you want to create a custom permanent link so just by this you can create this simply the you can write that is the first page so it will now uh, answer, write uh, it will now access by the name first dot html location if you want to select any location from here another options that reader comments you want to allow or do not allow show existing or do not allow hide existing so any settings you can select from here before publish you can see preview from here that how your blog post will look like so here is the post it will look like this uh, here is the september 18 date and the text here coming so as uh, i have just added some text that is why it is showing only this text and it is the name of my blog so here is the preview blog just uh, now if you want to publish it so just click on publish it will ask you this will publish this post to your blog confirm so now this post is published from here you can make any changes apply labels to this post if you want to delete this post it is the view button by this you can see the live preview of your blog so here is the live preview of your blog part okay so the name of your blogger is sdcamb2020 followed by dot blogspot.com and next is the name of your page that is first dot html so here is the simple way to create a blog post create a post in your blog till now we have learnt how to make a post in your blog so now move to next see here are the stats part it will show the number of post number of comments or number of followers to your blog spot your blog page here as i have only one post posted last time that's why it is showing only one post here comments part will show the comments present in your particular blog as uh, blog allow users to comment on your 
particular block. Earning part will be done after the creation of block part and when it become popular then you can earn from blogging. For that purpose you have to make an account in AdSense and uh, for AdSense there are many rules and regulations for that. Next we move to pages. So now let's understand how to create a page in a blog. Just clicking on pages you will get a link here that is new page. Click on that. So here is the interface of page. See here I want to show you one more thing about it. About the blog part is that as we have learned HTML and CSS portion. So we can use that HTML part here also. See if you are not able to understand what to do or uh, what to write or how to insert image or how to make images moving so here at corner left corner you see a link here is the html view and one is the compose view so one is compose view is showing you and when you click on html it will show you the html code part so you will work in both as it is up to you uh, just remember no need to include HTML tag and body tag. Simply write the contents you want to include in your particular page. So let's understand. See if you want to insert images here are for insert image here is the link. Upload for computer. Then the images you want. See I want these four images. Just simply insert. As I am inserting images in pages, you can insert images in post also. Previously we learnt about post, so uh, this by this way we can also insert images in post. So here we go, the images are inserted. Now let's see the HTML view part of this. See, that is the HTML view part of these images. So if you want to use mark you just simply insert a mark you tag in front and in the end so let's see now go to the compose view and see the preview of this particular page see so now mark you is working here so you can work in blog with your html code as well as with your simply inserting the by clicking the buttons you can insert image or if you want to use html code then you can use that okay so here is the mark view so there are many things like font type if you want to select any font or formatting tags are there coloring is there or from here if you want to insert a video so blogs are restric not restricted to just images or text. You can use uh, videos also in this particular page or in the post part. So if you want to publish it, this page settings for page settings here is only a simple option reader comments. You want to allow comments or not. You simply publish this page. After publishing it will save and will show in your pages part. See. So here is the pages part see I have uh, I have not given it a name so you have to give a name to it like it is a first page I am just giving the name that is first and simply you can update it so it is very easy to work with blogs now let's see the preview Here is the preview and uh, its name is also updated. Now let's try to insert a video in our page. I have created a page with name second and inserted a video from this particular link insert video. As this video takes too much time to insert that's why I am already inserted here. So now when you see the preview part the video will you will see the video here but when you try to click on it it will not work so for running the video you have to 
publish this page as i already published this page that's why this saying the update portion so from here now see the preview part now here is the preview when you try to click on it it will simply run the video so here is the video so by this way you can insert videos in your blog so now move to next after the pages part let's see the layout see layout uh, uh, describes uh, if you want to add something on your page or in uh, anything like header if you want a header on your page then you can add by here you want to change it like by simply click here if you want to change the header like i have write the blog title sanatan dharam college if you want to write blog description here then you can write here if you want to insert a image from here you can drag that particular image see let me insert some image so see various options are there behind title and description where you want to show the image instead of title and description that you want to don't want to show the title just simply display this image save this one so now header part is updated see let me show you the preview uh, let's uh, understand something more see here is the page list so if you want to see the page present on your uh, like uh, see here i'm just just already by default it is clicked the home button home page so if you want to show the these two pages also then simply click on that here you can also change the sequence like you want first page then second page or the you want to change the sequence then simply drag and drop it okay and at the end you have to save these changes otherwise it will not reflect your page so there are various options if you want the search button on the top like search this block you want to search anything on so if you want to show this then click on that otherwise just uncheck this button okay so save so now let me show you the preview part so here is the button first see here as i insert a image that's why it is showing like this so this is the first page then we want to see the second page click on first so second one is this. here is the second page which uh, is a video part so by this way you can change the layout of your particular blog theme part if you want to change the theme theme is just like your template so here as i selected this theme so my blog is based on this theme if you want to change the theme just simply click select a new theme from here you can select any theme which you like there are many themes see if you select this one it will ask you to customize or apply just apply okay if you want to change or want to see the preview from here let's see the preview so here is the preview So according to uh, preview of uh, according to the theme of template theme of uh, layout you will get the images as like this in previous one you can't see this particular image but in this this image is coming properly so here is the text and on this side you are getting the three pages one is your home page that is this one then is the first second and it is about me like my name here shikha verma is present here if i want to provide my profile detail then i can provide by this way so here are showing the post of september then move on october november up to so on if you will try if you will continuously work on it okay so if you want to customize this template like you want changes in this just simply click on customize see here main color theme is we want to change the main color theme like you want to change the color so 
from here you can change the color okay background and color to the theme by default reset means if you want to go back the previous adjust bits if you want to setting the width side side bar how many width is there for side bars layout so various options are there you can customize your template your theme here in block part okay so now next is your settings part settings part it basically for to make any changes any type of changes to your blog like the uh, basic information of title description any language or uh, privacy part if you want to uh, show this uh, blog to the search engines or not and the main thing i want to explain in the setting part is to delete the blog if you want to delete your blog then find the link remove your blog from here you can simply remove your blog by clicking the remove button just click on delete it will remove your blog and by permanently delete you can completely delete this blog from your machine and from the server part so now it is deleted so there is no blog 